Yeah. Yeah. What's up, guys? <laughs> Doug Polk here. What's up, guys? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, what's up, guys? So it is currently uh, like 12:15 right now. Uh, Tuesday, day two of the Monster Meetup game. Today is the two-five Meetup game. We have like there's like over 100 people on the list right now. It's pretty insane. So uh, we have like 45 minutes until that starts. Uh, we're just chilling right now, just relaxing, getting our mindset right. We're gonna head there, and I guess hopefully get a good table draw. I guess that's how it works. I'm not, I'm not really sure how it's gonna work, but. Uh, yeah, it's just gonna be so sick. Everyone's in town. It's just gonna be poker heaven. So we're gonna get there, try to make a few bucks, and uh, we'll keep you guys updated. So stay tuned and enjoy the action. So I know a lot of professional poker players kind of have like a warm-up routine before they go and play. And this is kind of like what I enjoy doing. I just like, kind of like to play a couple games of Warzone. Uh, I feel like it gets me in the zone and helps me focus. Uh, but yeah, leave in the comments below what you guys like to do before you play poker. Because in my opinion, it's very, very crucial to have a good warm-up plan. So yeah, leave it in the comments below what you guys do for your warm up. I'll see you later, dogs. I'll see you later. All right, so it's currently 1.27. We have about 33 minutes till the meetup game officially starts. So we're gonna stop by uh, one of my favorite spots, actually. It's kind of low key. It's right off of Dessau here in Austin, Texas, called Ken's Tacos. And uh, this place is super, super good and very, very affordable as well. And it's like a quarter mile away from my apartment. So can't complain there. So we're gonna stop by there, get a little bite to eat, and then we're gonna go put in some grind time. Kins is definitely one of those if you know you know spots, that's for sure, because it's only open from 6 to uh, 2 p.m. So it's not even open all day. And to be honest, it's kind of tucked in, kind of tucked back there. So if you blink, you miss it. Uh, but if you look it up, it's got excellent reviews. They're honestly known for their breakfast tacos. Right when I moved here, it was the very first local joint that I went to and ordered three of them. These things are about a half pound each and I couldn't even eat two. <laughs> They're just humongous. So if you ever go there, don't get more than two tacos because I'm a heavy eater and I couldn't even eat two. So, uh, but yeah, I highly recommend you try it out. So we have 15 minutes before uh, the meetup game starts. We're running, I guess, a little behind, but I mean, they're not gonna be able to wrestle up 100 poker players in immediately so I think we're doing all right so let's get there and let's do it all right and we have made it so uh, we're gonna get in there probably gonna just buy in for 1,000 uh, maybe 500 to start honestly the PLO bomb pots are really what makes this uh, 2 5 game completely different than any 2 5 game in the country it's a $25 PLO bomb pot that happens about two to three times every half hour. They happen at a pretty high frequency, so the variance is definitely there. Running good in these bomb pots is kind of crucial to crushing these two five games, but I feel like in this game, there's gonna be a lot of people that just have no idea how to play them, so we're gonna be able to take advantage of that. So uh, let's stop wasting time, let's get in there and start grinding. All right, so this parking lot actually isn't nearly as busy as I thought it was gonna be, so maybe the lines aren't gonna be that crazy, so. All right, that's not bad. All right, so we failed really, really miserably. The meetup game doesn't start till four. We're two hours early. Um, so we're, I guess we just put ourselves on the uh, one, two, two, five, and the one, three list, and uh, I guess we'll just wait and see what happens. But I guess it makes sense why there's not that many cars in the parking lot. All right, so we are back in the car. I'm still feeling a little low on energy from last night's session, the last two nights' session, so um, I'm just gonna kind of relax and just close my eyes for a little bit. Uh, I'll get a text whenever my seat becomes available, so. Hopefully that's sooner than later, but I'm honestly in no hurry. So, gonna shut our eyes, take a quick little cat nap. Well, we're uh, we're almost there. Fifteen now. 
<laughs> I'm actually, I think I'm, you could be my thousandth subscriber. All right. I'm at 999 right now, I think. <laughs> You're my man. God, that's so crazy. Right. Yeah. Everyone in the chat last night was like, "I don't think Brad's ready to play 100, 200." I'm like, "I'm like, well, the game's pretty much playing like 100, 200. Granted, 100, 200 might have you know, 400 dollars straddles, but." Yeah, yeah. Bill's showing up. That's gonna be insane. Okay. Yeah. That's what. That's what I heard. Let's go.
Walsh, Renee, Nick, Axel, B. Luna for one team of women. You know, you know. All right, so it is currently uh, like 10 o'clock at night. We played for 6.9 hours and profited a little over $2,100 in a really bad reg filled game. I don't know how we did it, but I mean, it was, we ended up making some money. Um, every hand today was heads up, three bet. Or four bet. I kid you not. It was um, it was a bloodbath, and uh, these games, like I said before in the last vlog, they're not getting easier. But, anyways, with that being said, uh, big shout out to the lodge staff. Uh, I know they had the supervisors and the manager has a lot of pressure going into something like this. The employees, you know, get their stress from the managers being stressed, and I didn't really sense that at all today. And for the lodge to be able to handle that kind of volume is just it was something really cool to be a part of, and. Uh, I'm just so excited to see what uh, the Lodge and Texas Poker has in store for the future. But with that being said, tomorrow is the $600 buy-in 500K guarantee tournament. Uh, we're going to fire one or two bolts in that, hopefully just one end bag. Uh, we came home early just because we'd like to get some sleep, and we also want to edit this vlog and have it uh, ready for you guys in the morning before you wake up. Uh, anyways, yeah, so that's I'm just going to close it out there. Please leave a like, comment, subscribe. Please subscribe to my vlog. I really, really appreciate it. I'm very sorry for quitting on you guys before, but I promise I'm not going to do it again. So with that being said, peace. Thank you.